hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel i hope you're all doing well um i'm just going to find the horses i'm going to the beach with my friend ashley um what time is it it's like seven o'clock 7 p.m oh my life the horses have absolutely trashed this fence oh my life no wonder my dad's annoyed at me sorry dad i will fix it anyway um this vlog i'm gonna do a bit of a week in the life i think is that what you call it i don't like that i don't think it sounds right um a week vlog no cows all just like other bits of stuff that i get up to because i've been requested to do that for a while now um it's easy doing the cows because i'm with the cows 24 7 literally but i have a few things come in coming i've got a few things going on this week that i thought would be quite fun to vlog so that's what i'm going to do and the first thing that we're doing is going to the beach so i'm just trying to find the horses i hope they're not at the other end of the field because i'm already late because i've been finishing another vlog off just finished milking and all that sort of stuff anyway i'm rambling now and i'm out of breath but also if you haven't done already i have just launched some merch i've got some hoodies some forever and welly hoodies so sorry excuse me if you would like to buy one purchase one whatever actually snapchatting me now because i'm late if you do want to buy one then i'm going to leave a, a link in the description box um and yeah go and grab your hoodies guys they're so nice they're really good quality nice subtle um detailing them on them which is what i wanted so yeah i love them and i hope you guys will too so that's that oh i really am out of breath i've lost my tripod again i feel like i say that on nearly every vlog i don't know how i lose them so easily right. Oh. Right, where are they where are i thought that was him then on the other side of the river where are they I can't see him anyway i'll see you in a bit found them as far away as they possibly could be from me running even extra late but that's just standard come on alfred and they're on a go slow as well which is just so annoying i'm gonna cut across this field actually so hopefully that'll speed us up a bit Right, put Alf in his stable. We're just gonna go and get in the trailer. <laughs> Come on, he's actually pulled both his shoes off. So, you know, winning, not to worry. But anyway, he's not lame. We're only on sand as well, aren't we? So I'm not really bothered, it's fine. Um, so yeah, just gonna load up now. Get 
Nice. <laughs> Just take it. Sharp. <laughs> Have you seen them already? One goes straight up, one goes away. Ready? Oh! 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 Days. Well, we're not doing so well. Well, I'm not. Have it a few. You're doing well. All right. Ash doing pretty well. The boys are doing quite well. Very well. But you know, they come every weekend. We don't. We come every year. <laughs> I actually have been once this year. I don't think I've been at all. Have you not? Uh, oh, you're doing really well then. Her ears are ringing. Oh yeah. So. Don't forget your uh, ear defence guys. Ear protection. Mine's here. I'm getting her. wear protection. Oh and I've also got me, got me hoodie on. Can you see because of my hair? I haven't. No. <laughs> I'll taking, let it out. I'm taking it off. Her. <laughs> Sick of it. Just picked up my first order of hoodies. So I've just literally just got home with them now and I'm going to start packing them up. Um and take them all to the post office. Ah! I've got mine on, one of mine. I've got a green one, black one. <clears throat> um, I think I'm gonna get a navy and a gray as well and just see what they do look like. Really like the pink ones as well, but I feel like I'd get it so dirty. But I could wear it around the house, I suppose. I don't know, I'll probably get one of each color, let's be honest. But yeah, you can really, so I've done the embroidery the same color as the hoodie, Um, but you can, you can really see it when the sun's on and i just really like how subtle it is i think it looks good let me know what you think anyway write in the comments if you like the design of them this is my little logo and then there's forever and wellies on the back i'll show you when i get inside because i'll lay them out on the table so you can have a proper look at them um but yeah excited thanks so much everyone that has already ordered um and yeah i'll get them shipped out to you quick as i can so here they are i'm just inside now packing some up so this is a pink one so we've got the the bit there on the um, on the front chest, this bit on the arm, and then on the back as well. We've got the forever in wellies. So yeah, I think the pink's really cute. I really like the pink. Probably doesn't show it that well with the the colour of it there with the lighting. And then um, we've got some green ones. Most of them are green, to be fair. That's like the most popular colour. So, yeah. Uh, I've got some black ones as well. Yeah, so the black ones, we've just... Um, we've not redone the black ones. We've just... Um, I picked a different thread to hopefully show it up a little bit more um, when it's on the jumper. I Oh, I actually have a black one here, actually. This is my black one. Sorry. Again, no tripod not ideal right this is the black one this is mine so this is one that we like tested on can you see it there in the light um but i've just chosen a little bit of a different shade um thread just so you can see it when you're outside in the sun you can really see it like really does show it up so you can see that my idea was to be subtle and it is subtle <laughs> um and then again it's just all the same design I just think it looks really nice. I'm really happy with them anyway, so yeah. Just on with packing some now. Um, I'm writing out, I'm trying to do it so I don't lose track. So I've got all my, oh, actually this is a pink one. So for the pink ones, I got pink bags. So yeah. So I feel like it's gonna take me a while and then I need to get to the post office and get them all sent out ideally today, really. All before milking. Fingers crossed I can do it. So, as you know, my horses live out and this is the current state of his stable. 
This is just the dogs. I forget to sh like shut the doors and then they just come in and dig it all out. So I'm just going to sort his bed out. Freddie's been playing in it as well. Um, and then... Yeah, so I'm going to sort all of his stable out and stuff. And then with the weather turning... I say turning. Well, I got up this morning and it was absolutely chucking it down. So, and the horses are still living out and I felt a little bit bad for them. Um, but I've no hay or anything. So I'm just going to sort everything out get my pallets uh, sat down outside my stable so I can put a hay bale outside because I put like a large hay bale outside each stable rather than um, giving them hay nets and stuff. One, it's, it made my life so easy last year, like so, so easy. So I'm doing it all the time now. It's been, I absolutely love it. Saves me doing hay nets. They've got food all the time. I don't have to make sure I'm here for like a certain time or like worried that they're going to run out of hay because they won't. So yeah, just gonna have a bit of a sort out in here. Uh, I might nip to Stanna, which is our local um, feed place. Oh, sorry. Oh. And yeah, repping the merch yet again. Um, if you want one, if you want one ordered, this is my green. This is a large, which I'm not really can't really get high enough. On me, it actually is quite baggy and I'm a, I'm a size say 14 16 um so I've also got a medium as well which I like which is a more fitted but this one's dead comfy because it's like over oversized so that's if you wanted a little guide reference but they are pretty true to true to size um so yeah get one ordered I'll leave the um the link in the description box also my specs I'm wearing my specs because run out of contact lenses i've not run out of contact lenses in literally years because i'd like almost back well not even backstopped them but like i don't know i had spare contact lenses everywhere i've literally ransacked the house looking for contact lenses and i've got two sets right i've got one set which is fine and i'm saving them for the weekend because i'm going showing with my friend um and i didn't want to wear glasses for it and then I've also found another set which looks like packaging from about 10 years ago. Like, no exaggeration. So, I'm not sure if they go out of date. I don't know if my eyeball is going to, like, fall out as I put this contact lens in. <laughs> Dramatic, I know. But you never know. So, I don't know. I might save them if I'm extra, extra def desperate. I've got a week to wait and I don't know how long I can last wearing glasses. It's not, it's not a vibe. It's not a vibe when you work with cows all the time. Anyway, right, I'm going to get on now because I've rambled on for like four minutes now, so yeah. Like I said, the horse is still living out, so it's fine for now. When they're living in, when my horse is living, I am like proper OCD about the beds. <laughs> um, not that you can tell right now because they look an absolute state. But anyway, it is what it is. Um, I'm gonna get some more shavings um, for Michael. I'm not doing anything with Alf's next door. I'm not even going to show you it because it's a right mess. There's literally nothing in it. Okay, I will show you in it. <laughs> so this is it, basically. It's just an empty stable. I don't know what is going on with the horses at the minute, but they are trashing them. Soon going to be a hole in there. That'll be filled with a bank in though, so it should be fine. So yeah, they, um, they are very big stables, these. So they're a good size. That's the bedding that's just been left in here from previous horse. I uh, can't even remember who's would have been in here before this. Um, it's Michael's old, old bed anyway, because I've switched him back to next door now. So, yeah, that's just for when Alf comes in. And uh, if I'm like riding Michael or anything, he can just stand in and then he's got somewhere to wee. But I'm not putting a full bed in here. There's absolutely no point. Last bit of the hay before I put a hay bale here on my pallet. Because I cut windows out of here, so it would make it so much easier for me. And it does. Last time I put a bale on, I broke that, so I need to take that off and get a new one. To be fair, I might just take it off. Alice can get one if she wants one. Have I swapped his door over yet? I've not even swapped his door over. I might 
I could do that as well, I'll go and get the drill. Um, yeah. So I actually thought I'd lost my tripod, which I had for like two weeks. Nah, a week. Anyway, I found it. So yeah, I'm dead happy about that now. <laughs> oh, because I literally was on Amazon last night in the parlor and I was like, I'm just gonna have to buy another one. Which would have been literally like my fifth tripod since starting YouTube this year. Six in a year. So I was like, I just can't do it. It's cost me a fortune. Anyway, quite a bit of information, but yeah, I was happy I found it. I'm just getting the Kramer now. Um, Glenn's little stable, if you watch them, another vlog of mine is full of a load of old stuff. Well, not even old stuff, just stuff that I don't even use. So I'm just gonna go now, uh, put it all in the Kramer bucket, and then I can burn it, sort it out, put it on the scrap heap, wherever it needs to go, it all just needs sorted out. So I'm just gonna do that now. some nearly off bananas. Bella, it's me, your nana. So I'm making a banana loaf. Right. Classic. Left my tripod at the farm. Let's see if I can do this. Ooh. I was going to film me actually doing it all, but I f completely forgot. So, you know, here we go. This is the best bit though. Right, I need both hands now. Also, it's night time. I'm not just in my dressing gown for the crack. <laughs> just got home from work, uh, had a shower, had a quick bit of tea, and then thought I'd do this. Do you want to lick this out, guys? My little dishwashers. I absolutely love banana loaf. I think it, you know what? I actually think it's one of my faves. It's up there anyway. Oh, lovely. Good girl. Mmm. Clean that out for me. I just need to wash everything up now. So I'm making a banana loaf because one, I had the bananas to use up. And also it's my granddad's birthday tomorrow. So I'm gonna give him half of it um, so he can have it with his brews and stuff. I've got him a card as well. And I've also got him um, from all of us, from me, Meg and Ben, um, a picture book that you make on like, what's it called? Free prints or photo book. I don't know, it's one or the other. Anyway, I've got him one of them because he loves looking at pictures, so hopefully he's gonna love it. Um, that's not coming for another day or two. I only just figured out how to actually make it today. I don't know why that took me so long to figure it out, but it did. Um, so yeah, so I thought tomorrow is actual birthday. I could just give him his card and some cake, and then I'll say that his present's on his way or whatever. Now, I'm gonna have to post this after now because I know my granddad watches my YouTube, so he's going to know what I've got him for his birthday. <laughs> so I'm going to have to post this later on so he doesn't see this and be like, oh, it's no surprise now. So never mind. Hey, Alexa, play country music. Volume five. Uh, 
volume one. Right, so I got these really cute little cards from a gift shop near me. That's a thank you one. This one's perfect for Grandad. It's only tiny, but I love the tractors and it's just dead cute. So I'm going to give him that. And then also, because I've... This is me fully adulting, by the way. This is... I'm impressed with myself anyway. Here. Yeah. These are little tiny cake boxes, which are really cute. So I'm going to create the box and I'm going to give him the banana loaf in this, which is so cute. That's just wet because I've just wiped it. But yeah, so I write his little card, make his little box for his banana loaf, which I'll have to put him when it's cold actually, won't I? Because I don't want it to go soggy. cute <laughs> i love these i need to get some more i don't know where i got these from i think i got them from amazon but they're so cute love it right i just need for my cake to bake now oh wow that was a stiff get up hello get down please uh so yeah forgot to show you i'm, I'm at the farm now obviously day after put them on the mower i've got his stuff here so that's them finished I think I've actually just seen him as well on the farm, so I need to tell him that they're here for him. Cute. So, also, just in the wash house, just move them so you can't see our address at the wall, and Amazon have just been, major Amazon haul. Saw this on another YouTuber thing. Apparently this is meant to be really, really good. Um, so yeah, got some of that. And then I went a bit crazy on the... I went on skims yesterday because I wanted some more tops and stuff. Oh, this isn't skims. These are just makeup sponges. Cute. Um, yeah, I went on skims, looked on, and I put, like, four things in my basket, which I wanted, and it came to, like, well over 100 quid. I can't actually remember. And then I bought some T-shirts off Amazon, which were called Skin Dupes. And then since then, I've, I've ordered a load more here. Ooh, oh my God, that feels so nice. Oh, oh, I hope this feels, I hope this is as good on as it feels. Oh my God, love that. So I got like a um, chocolate brown. Maybe I should show you these at home. Uh, Bodysuit. I'll show you these at home because this video is just pointless. Uh, that is, feels incredible. What else did I get? I've run out of my foundation. Love this foundation. Literally my holy grail. <gasps> oh, that's that. <laughs> Aw, I'm missing one. I'm sure I ordered three tops. Unless there's two in here. There it is. So then I got another black. What black one did I get? So I already got black. Oh yeah, I wanted a black long sleeve. Got a black long sleeve. And then I got another chocolate coloured, which... I don't like the colour of that. That's like chestnut. I'm not into that, I don't think. I'll try it on. That's a funny colour. Um, I can work in that if I don't like it. But yeah. So that Amazon haul. Okay, so I thought I'd just show you. Excuse the bed, it's not made. Um, the tops I got from Amazon. So this is the first one. I've just rolled it up. It's a normal... I don't know if I should get on the bed. You know, normal black long sleeve top. It's a Skims dupe. Now this one, you can see my bra through it. It's not the best. But if I was wearing a black bra, it'd be absolutely fine. I just rolled mine up a little bit so you can see. Gives me a bit more of a waist. Um, but yeah, it was, I'm pretty sure this was eight quid. So, I mean, you can't go wrong at that, can you? Um, anyway, yeah, I'll show you them all stuck right this is the one that i didn't like the color of and again oh this is see-through as well i mean my bra is bright white so it's probably not the best advocate for it is that the right word um but actually the top itself i actually don't mind the color of it and also if i like excuse the boobs yeah if i like doubled it up see what i mean my bra is white so 
that's not so bad. Yeah, I actually quite like that. It's better than I thought anyway. But anyway, the next brown is like the one that I really wanted. Now, when I say this feels like butter, it is so, so soft. Now, this is actually a bodysuit, which I'm not going to do it up because I've got gym leggings on at the minute and I can't be bothered. But this... I think I'll double check, but this one might have been like twelve pounds, maybe eighteen. I can't remember, but still, the Skims ones of these. I do have a Skims one, and it's very similar to this, and it cost me like sixty quid. Don't get me wrong, I absolutely love it, and I wear it all the time. It's um, it's no sleeves on it. I've washed it hundreds of times, and it is really good. But love it for how much it was literally can't go wrong and i love the color as well the color is just what i wanted so dead happy with them good old amazon you can't beat it um so yeah little amazon haul for you <laughs> i've just got to manchester it's been a hell of a morning and i'm so tired you know when you've been like dead busy and then you just sit down and then it all just like hits you at once and you go really tired Anyway, um, yeah, so I've milked this morning and I'm now just in Manchester. I'm literally just about to walk into PLT. I'm just doing fit modeling today. Um, no makeup, no hair, none of that. So I've literally just curled my hair just so I look half presentable. But yeah, I'm not gonna be able to show you a Rylo when I'm in here, but I'm hopefully gonna show you a little bit of inside. Who knows? <laughs> So here we are, we're in the fit room now. Um, I'm just waiting for my team, which are two other girls, one that fits the clothes onto me and the other one that writes all the notes and stuff, um, which they are coming in in a second. Here they are, this is my rail of clothes. So these were sign off pictures. So I've got to try on all of them outfits, take pictures in them all so that the teams that have created them um, can see what they look like on a model now I did do a little time lapse of this and I've just watched through it and I'm naked on nearly all of it so I've deleted that <laughs> So I've got it to go because I was meant to be off not milking this afternoon because me and Ashley were going to drive down to Warwickshire because we've got a show with a horse which I am vlogging separate vlog um but Dan who works for us went home this morning because he was throwing up all morning so that's not great so I think I'm actually gonna have to milk now which is a little bit annoying so I'm just gonna set off home eat my stuff in the car because I'm gonna have some stuff to sort out before we go to the show because I'm now milking you know what I mean it's all a bit full on I haven't really got time for any of this stuff but hey ho Ashley's done my hoodie orders for me today so shout out to Ashley because otherwise I would have been struggling so 
I mean, the chips are insane. But how am I meant to eat my bow bun? He's buried it. But this and the water and everything was like £4.50. That is so cheap. So shout out to PLT for that. <laughs> Saves me going to McDonald's or something. I love a bit of salt and pepper chicken and chips. So yeah, I'm looking forward to eat this. Okay, so um, I've just got back from Manchester. Um, and then, what am I doing now? I don't know what time it is. I think it's nearly milking time, so I need to be quick. I need to pack my bags because I'm going to a horse show. Um, I have sort of packed it, but I need to just get everything together. And then I need to go to the farm straight away and start milking early because I want to try and finish early to then set off on this like three hour drive, which I'm really hoping Ashley will drive because after just driving to Manchester, I can't be bothered. I'm dead sleepy. Driving makes me sleepy. So hopefully she'll drive. Um, but yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this uh, vlog. Sorry. Um, yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this vlog. Um, people have been requesting it more off my Instagram than off my YouTube. So I would like to know if you've enjoyed it, if you want me to do more stuff like this, of like days in the life or weeks in the life or what have you. Because um, I've actually enjoyed doing this one. It's nice not to just do cows all the time. So yeah, please do let me know in the comments if you want more like this. Um and I'll be happy to do that. Uh, if you haven't done already, please do like and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram. And I will see you on the next one. Bye, guys.